the Armin Air Defense Missile System is a state-of-the-art, medium-range, high-altitude missile defense system developed indigenously by Iran. It stands as a testament to Iran's commitment to self-reliance and innovation in military technology, particularly in the face of international sanctions and regional security challenges. Introduced on February 17, 2024, in a ceremony attended by Iranian Defense Minister Brigadier General Mohammad Reza Ashtiani, the Arman system has become a cornerstone of Iran's national defense strategy, safeguarding sensitive areas against a wide array of aerial threats. The technical capabilities of the Arman system position it among the most advanced in its class. It boasts a maximum engagement range of 120 kilometers and a peak operational altitude of 27 kilometers, enabling it to intercept threats at various altitudes effectively. Utilizing advanced radar technology, the system provides 360-degree detection coverage, identifying up to 24 targets within a range of 180 to 200 kilometers and engaging up to six targets simultaneously. This capability ensures that the Arman system is highly effective against coordinated and multi-pronged aerial attacks. The Arman employs the Syad 3F missile, a variant of the Syad 3 missile designed for vertical launch. Each missile measures 6.1 meters in length, weighs approximately 1,000 kilograms, and features a diameter of 40 centimeters. These missiles are capable of intercepting short-range ballistic missiles, anti-radiation missiles, cruise missiles, guided bombs, helicopters, and drones with remarkable precision. The system's rapid response mechanism with a reaction time of less than 20 seconds and full operational readiness achieved in just three minutes underscores its utility in dynamic and high stakes combat scenarios. The deployment of the Arman system aligns with Iran's broader strategic objectives of enhancing national defense and asserting technological independence. By focusing on indigenous development, Iran has not only circumvented the limitations imposed by international sanctions, but also strengthened its ability to counter modern threats posed by advanced weapon systems from regional adversaries, such as Israel and the United States. The Arman's design explicitly addresses the challenges posed by these adversaries, incorporating advanced radar and missile technology to neutralize cutting-edge aerial and ballistic threats effectively. In terms of operational history, the Arman system has been deployed to protect critical infrastructure, military bases, and urban centers. While detailed accounts of its combat performance remain limited due to its recent introduction, the system's technical specifications suggest that it is well-suited to counter modern guided munitions and aerial attacks in diverse combat scenarios. Its rapid deployment capability and comprehensive coverage make it an invaluable asset in defending against sudden and unexpected threats. Comparatively, the Arman system holds its ground against regional competitors such as the Israeli David Sling and the American Patriot systems. While these systems are backed by extensive operational histories and advanced Western technology, the Arman system offers a cost-effective and domestically produced alternative tailored to Iran's specific security needs. Its integration of advanced radar and missile technology, coupled with its ability to simultaneously engage multiple targets, positions it as a formidable counterpart in the regional air defense landscape. However, the system's performance under real-world combat conditions remains to be thoroughly tested, a factor that will ultimately determine its effectiveness relative to its competitors. In Iran's modern warfare doctrine, the Arman system plays a crucial role in ensuring strategic deterrence and defending against the growing complexity of aerial threats. It reflects Iran's emphasis on asymmetric warfare and technological innovation, aiming to offset the military advantages of its adversaries. By securing critical assets and demonstrating advanced defensive capabilities, the Arman system not only enhances Iran's defensive posture, but also serves as a symbol of its technological and strategic resilience.
Iran's historical context and geopolitical challenges provide a deeper understanding of the significance of the Arman system. For decades, Iran has faced military and economic sanctions, particularly from the United States and its allies, aimed at curbing its influence in the region. These sanctions have pushed Iran to prioritize domestic innovation and self-reliance in military technology. The Arman system is a product of these efforts, embodying the technological advancements achieved despite limited access to global defense markets. The development of the Arman system also underscores Iran's commitment to countering advanced threats posed by adversaries. Israel, for instance, has been a major regional rival with highly advanced air defense systems like the Iron Dome and David Sling. These systems have set a benchmark for missile defense technology capable of intercepting a wide range of threats with exceptional precision. In response, the Arman system incorporates similar multi-layered defense mechanisms, showcasing Iran's ambition to match or even surpass regional standards. The Arman system's integration into Iran's defense infrastructure is part of a broader shift toward modernizing its armed forces. In recent years, Iran has introduced a range of domestically produced military equipment, including drones, naval vessels, and ballistic missiles. This modernization effort reflects a strategic pivot toward achieving technological parity with regional adversaries and deterring external aggression. By deploying advanced systems like Arman, Iran aims to protect its sovereignty and maintain a strategic balance in the region. From a technical perspective, the Arman system's radar and missile capabilities represent a leap forward in Iran's defense technology. The 360-degree radar coverage eliminates blind spots, providing comprehensive situational awareness and early threat detection. This capability is critical in defending against modern warfare tactics, where adversaries often use stealth and coordinated attacks to overwhelm defenses. The ability to simultaneously engage multiple targets further enhances the system's utility in complex combat scenarios. The Syed 3F missile, used in the Armin system, is a cornerstone of its effectiveness. With a maximum range of 120 kilometers and an engagement altitude of 27 kilometers, the missile is versatile enough to counter diverse threats, including low-flying drones and high-altitude ballistic missiles. The missile's vertical launch capability allows for rapid deployment, ensuring a swift response to incoming threats. This feature is particularly valuable in high-intensity conflicts, where reaction time is a critical factor in determining success. The Arman system's ability to counter stealth technologies is another notable feature. Modern aerial threats, such as fifth-generation fighter jets and stealth drones, are designed to evade traditional radar systems. The advanced radar technology integrated into the Arman system addresses this challenge, providing robust detection and targeting capabilities even against low observable aircraft. This capability positions the Arman system as a vital asset in countering the growing sophistication of aerial threats in the region. In terms of strategic deployment, the Arman system is likely to be stationed near critical infrastructure, including nuclear facilities, oil refineries, and major urban centers. These locations are frequent targets of potential adversaries and require robust defense mechanisms to ensure their security. The mobility of the Arman system further enhances its strategic value, allowing it to be redeployed quickly in response to emerging threats. This flexibility is crucial in a dynamic security environment where the nature and location of threats can change rapidly.